Hello and welcome to the Fall 2021 Phi Theta Kappa Honor Society induction at Montgomery County Community College organized by the Alpha Kappa Zeta chapter of Phi Theta Kappa. My name is Dr. Katherine Parzinski and I am one of the Phi Theta Kappa faculty advisors here at Montgomery County Community College. The Alpha Kappa Zeta chapter which I represent along with Dr. Kathy holt Schering, was started at the Bluebell campus in 1985. Phi Theta Kappa celebrates four hallmarks, scholarship, fellowship, leadership, and service. The students in our chapter engage in service projects every fall and spring semester and work to make their campus a better place. Our current officers are Emily Dugan, Caitlin Schudhart, Darcy Mossholder, and Emily McCarthy. We will begin the ceremony with comments from Dr. Victoria Bastecki Perez. Dr. Victoria Bastecki Perez, a first generation college student herself, became the sixth president of Montgomery County Community College in May of 2020. As the leader of the institution, Dr. Bastecki Perez relies on her decades long experience in academia to guide the college in the 21st century. Welcome Dr. Bastecki Perez. It is truly my honor to join you in celebrating your academic leadership and service accomplishments at the college and in our communities. You will hear throughout the program from your chapter advisors and student leaders about PTK, the National and International Honor Society for Community College students that the college has been affiliated with since 1985. Our college has two chapters, Alpha Kappa Zeta chapter in Bluebell and the Beta Tau Lambda chapter in Pottstown. Both of our chapters have attained the five star status, which is the highest rank possible for member chapters. As the newest members of our college's PTK, you exemplify the four hallmarks of scholarship, fellowship, leadership, and service. Inductees, you have demonstrated your commitment to these hallmarks both inside and outside the classroom, serving as members of clubs and athletic teams, leading outreach initiatives in our communities, and of course, for your academic coursework. On behalf of the entire Monco family, including our board of trustees, your fellow students, our faculty, staff, alumni of more than 65,000 members, and of course myself. I am proud of your efforts and your continued work as you pursue your academic goals. I look forward to connecting with you throughout this academic year as you complete your honors and actions projects. Once again, congratulations for a job well done. Hello, I am Emily Dugan, president of the Alpha Kappa Zeta chapter of Phi Theta Kappa. I'm pleased to welcome you into the installation of our new Phi Theta Kappa members this evening. These students are about to be initiated in the scholarly fellowship, which embraces community colleges not only in our own state, but the nation and internationally. Our society is Phi Theta Kappa, and our chapter is Alpha Kappa Zeta. Phi Theta Kappa was founded in 1918 and officially recognized in 1929 by the American Association of Junior Colleges. Today, it has grown from the original eight chapters to over 700 rare and alumni chapters nationwide. The purpose of Phi Theta Kappa is to recognize and encourage our hallmarks of scholarship, fellowship, leadership, and service among two-year college students. In pursuit of these ideals, Phi Theta Kappa becomes more than a club. Its members enter into an intellectual and cultural fellowship that extends beyond our campus to regional and national networks. 
in Alpha Kappa Zeta chapter. Our new members will find an atmosphere of scholarship. Our purpose is to foster a spirit of devotion and to study and develop principles that are embodied in the Greek letters, which stand for light, aspiration, and purity. My fellow students, here before you have fulfilled all the requirements for membership, and we are pleased to accept them in the National Phi Theta Kappa fraternity. Each of these initiates maintains a cumulative grade point average of 3.5 or above. This is at last as many A's as B's. Each initiate is more than deserving of this honor. Shukar had the white rose typifying purity and beauty of life with its white buds signifying intellectual associations. I, Emily McCarthy, have in my hand a torch, symbolic of knowledge, which is the servant of wisdom, which dwells with prudence and leads the way to righteousness in the midst of the paths of judgment. I, Darcy Mossholder, present this emblem of Phi Theta Kappa consists of a golden slab keyed at the top and bottom. The golden field refers to the golden opportunities that abound on every hand for society folk to evidence their culture and perform good works. Across the slab you will observe the black band. It represents the three ideals which band us together. Shining through the black enameled background are the three Greek letters, which are the initials of those three mystic Greek words meaning wisdom, aspiration, and purity. Beneath the band is a wreath, on the one side composed of oak leaves, and on the other, laurel. The oak leaves stand for stability and strength of character as symbolized by the mighty oak. The graceful curling leaves of the laurel signify achievement and success, all attributes for membership in our society. Above the band is the representation of the head of Athena, the goddess of learning. This badge stands as a symbol for the high idealism of our organization and membership in our group. I'm Carrie Manson and I'm a history major. My name is Lindsay Bechtel. My major is Human Services Addictions Concentration. Hello everyone, my name is Shia Watson and I am an early education major. Hey, what's up guys? I'm Peyton, I'm 19 years old and I'm a sophomore at Monco and I am currently studying exercise science. I'm a part-time student and a full-time professional athlete. I do BMX racing and I competed in Tokyo this year at the Olympics and I'm also a children's book author. Hi, my name is Chanel, I am 38 years old. I'm currently attending Montgomery County Community College 
for human services with a concentration in gerontology. Upon graduation, I will be transferring to Wilmington University where I'll be working my way up to my PhD in clinical mental health counseling. My name is Rocco Pistelli and I'm a criminal justice major. These students have fulfilled all requirements for membership and have been selected because they have chosen scholarship, leadership, service, and fellowship as their hallmarks. I, Catherine Persinski, recommend them for acceptance into the Alpha Kappa Zeta chapter of Phi Theta Kappa International Honor Society of two-year colleges. These new members have joined a scholarly fellowship which embraces two-year colleges not only in our own state but the nation and the world. I am pleased to welcome these students into our honor society. As we close, let me introduce Dr. Gloria Okolome, the Vice President of Academic Affairs here at the college to share some final thoughts. Hello, I'm Dr. Gloria Okolome, Vice President of Academic Affairs. It is my honor to join our students as they were inducted into the Phi Theta Kappa Honor Society today. The mission of Phi Theta Kappa is to recognize academic achievement of college students, as well as to provide opportunities for growth as scholars and leaders. I'm a firm believer in that it takes a village to achieve your goals. And as we conclude today's ceremony, I want to take the opportunity to thank all the individuals in the Montco Village, faculty, staff, friends, family, PTK advisors. Thank you for all that you do to support our student inductees as they pursue their academic and career pathways. I echo the sentiments shared earlier by Dr. Basteki Perez in congratulating all of our inductees on their achievements. And I also look forward to connecting with all of you throughout the year as you complete your honors and action projects. Again, best wishes with continued success in the upcoming academic year. Thank you. Mm -hmm.